Oh, look who it is! Hello, welcome back to my kitchen. It is me, Matt, from Fit and Confident You. Welcome back to the Fit and Confident Universe. We're gonna be doing some more cooking. Very excited. Hey, do you know what the internet needs? That's right, another recipe for protein pancakes. Coming right up! What's that you say? Underserved recipe idea? You're totally right! Coming at you with a brand new pew pew pew! Uh, I don't know what's going on, quite frankly. Here's what you need. Four dry ingredients. Whole slash plain flour. That's it. <laughs> Just joking. Uh, a little bit of baking powder, a pinch of salt, and if you fat, if you're that way inclined, which I am, a little, little bit of nutmeg, just like a pinch, because we're not making very many. Um, then some wet ingredients. Yes, you need, well, if, uh, if you're going to follow me, you need two eggs. Two eggs, not ostrich eggs, that would be silly. Two regular hen's eggs, please. Uh, then you also need a squeeze of honey, that's just for sweetness, and cottage cheese, that's where the protein comes from. Well, and the eggs as well, but there's more protein density in that there cottage cheese uh, and then either some butter or oil or that spray stuff for cooking what we're going to do is very simply mix the dry ingredients mix the wet ingredients combine a vu and then put it in a pan let's see how that turns out okay one sec pay attention here's the science Okay, so you've just seen the pictures. I combined my dry ingredients first, then my wet ingredients, and then they've made this mmm, delicious looking muck. If your batter is too runny after you've combined the wet and dry ingredients, just put a little bit more flour in. Not much, just to thicken it up so it holds together slightly more. And there will still be chunks, delicious, of cottage cheese in there. That's meant to be there. Okay, Barbara? Okay. Now, let's get it in the pan. Rosary reporter on the scene, first for you with the pancakes. She's in there. Oh, I went a bit heavy handed with the butter. Uh, but you know, Percy Pancakes having a lovely time there. More on this story as it happens. Ben, over to you in the studio. Breaking news man makes amazing pancake. Ah! Light and fluffy, that's what the baking powder does. Not too heavy-handed, you don't want it to explode. But this is gonna be good. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, delightful. Oh, 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 Matt is the biggest tosser in the house. <laughs> mm. So, in summary, delicious, easy, high in protein, don't talk with your mouth on that, it's rude. Um, something you can do when you're combining the wet ingredient is put some fruit in it, or chocolate chips. Uh, the recipe I originally saw and updated and made better uh, had some pineapple chunks, which actually would give it a nice little bit of sweetness and a bit of juiciness, but I think it's quite nice that it is, because I like a sort of a pancake that walks the savoury sweet line. But a little bit of extra honey on top, hey, whatever you fancy, don't let me hold you back, would be delicious. So there we go, delicious protein pancakes, super easy. Look at that, look, 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 oh, light and fluffy. Um, really tasty. And uh, for people who don't like cottage cheese, a way to use cottage cheese. So I'm gonna leave you now with that thought. Have a fitter, confident week, and I will see you back in my kitchen soon.